welcome to the 19th Annual International Mango Festival, the Mangoes of Hawaii. Every mango in front of you on here is grown right here in South Florida, okay, in the Fairchild Farm. So these are not imported from in, anywhere. These varieties, there's over 250 varieties on the table, and they're from our farm. We are very proud to have the largest and more important mango collection in the planet. We work a century, basically, from David Fairchild to put together this collection. So why we choose Hawaii? First of all, it's part of the United States. It's the other place that we can grow mangoes besides Florida and California. Aloha! Aloha! You have got to buy local. And if the owner of Publix is here now, I apologize now. But it's very disappointing, in a sense, for me to walk into a grocery store here and see all the mangoes from Mexico. You've got to support places like Fairchild and the local fruit stands. And, and, and go for what is grown here. What kind is this? This is a oh, I better try my own mango. How about that? All right, I'm trying it. One of the nice things about this is most of these mangoes are, are not found anywhere else in the United States. And you don't see them in supermarkets, so this is kind of a unique tasting opportunity. And the people do really enjoy it. <laughs> they are a sensual fruit. They're delicious. They're great to stand over a sink and just let it drip all over you. This is very civilized eating. This was pretty amazing. Wow. Is it? This is a mango relative from Benjamarsan, um, Indonesia, and it's thought to be a different species related to mango. This is one of the few varieties that's very resistant to anthracnose and has a really good flavor that uh, kind of tastes like passion fruit with some mango. If you were to cut it open, it has a deep orange flesh. It's quite fibrous, but when you're eating it, you don't mind getting the fibers between your teeth. It's that good. Aloha! <laughs> it's pretty bad when it, when eating mangoes becomes a job. Mango originated in India, and uh, a billion people they love this mango. It's called Alfonso, and this is my favorite mango. When I came to this country 20 years back and uh, went to grocery store to look for mangoes here, and I had a difficulty finding a flavored mango, and. Uh, I decided to see that how I can bring this mango. So I worked on that lifting up the ban of Indian mango. So I became the first importer of the mango in the United States. And uh, when the mango landed here in America, everybody felt bigger than landing on the moon, honestly. And we feel complete, I think, you know, because uh, this is our, our cultural diet, you can call it. Uh, and uh, everybody in India, those who grew up, has a story to tell about. And uh, I think if we wanted to carve the mango in American people's heart, we need to give them a right mango.